Gravitas Ventures is offering a tale in Asian horror that combines rather clever wordplay on the title and an eclectic approach to the tale. A cinematic class is about to begin, and your professor is in. Greetings, salutations, and other sundry affair. I am your cinematic professor and purveyor of truth. In movies, and tonight's lesson plan is a film called Repossession. And although it's an Asian-made horror film, it is in English. You do not have to read the subtitles. You know, you have to feel sorry for Jim. He is just having an absolutely terrible day. He loses his job as a high-paid executive, even though he's done magnificent work, and he finds himself out on the... Isn't that the way it always is? You do a great job, and they end up throwing you on the sidewalk? So in order to continue supporting his family, he begins driving people around in his own individual car, kind of like a, uh, a private Uber, if you will. Well, that works for a while, but he's not making enough money to pay the bills. And as a result, he starts getting, eh, let's say, problems at home. In addition, he has some rather sketchy adventures with the clients that he's picking up. And guess what? His best friend, who is trying to mentor him through this entire process, his confidant, if you will, may be a belligerent demon. Now, this is all Murphy's Law on steroids. Okay, let me tell you some of the people behind the scenes here. First, in front of the camera, Gerald Crew plays Jim. He's our uh, poor put-upon protagonist. Amy Chen plays Linda, his wife. And Matthew Liu plays the boy. Behind the camera, we have the writer and director is Go Ming Su, and our editor is Gregory Tay. They do a nice job on all of this. You know, you got to feel sorry for Jim. He's really trying to do the best that he can do in this uh, in this tale, but he is thwarted at every turn. And then, on top of everything, the supernatural enters the fray. Well, there seems to be uh, no way that Jim can rebound from all of this. Does he manage to do it? Uh, you're going to have to tune in and find out. I will give you a little hint, though, and tell you that the results in this movie are very violent, but they are explained to you in full through the courtesy of the demons. I told you there was wordplay in this, and repossession comes with a... Uh, well, you know, you think of something being repossessed, and that is certainly the, the car. So he, you know, when he falls back in uh, payment on his bills, they're going to repossess his car, and that's the only way he's making a living now. Uh, you find out that Jim has a sordid uh, history of uh, demonic possession, so we have a repossession uh, happening again there, and then, of course, the the uh, relationship with his wife. So nice little wordplay. It's not a bad little horror film. We're going to give it a nice C plus for effort. And now that you have learned what you have learned, here endeth your lesson.